7 0 defeat to STM. How do you think the game went? Not the best performances that we've ever put in today. Uh, uh, very poor performance throughout the team. Um, I think it shows in, in the dressing room afterwards. Everybody's had a, had a stern look at themselves, and uh, we can't accept performances like that, unfortunately. And uh, yeah, give credit to STM, sharp side. Uh, boy up top has pretty much run the show. But, you know, it's a steep learning curve, as I said, but you know, to allow a player to be able to go through play, through players like he did and score goals, then you've got to start questioning what's going on with the defence. But uh, yeah, very disappointed. We'll get him back in now on Tuesday, and uh, and we'll have a we'll go again. Um, but there's some deep soul searching to be done there today with that performance, and uh, I won't accept it from my players, unfortunately. And uh, now two weeks break for the first team, is that a sort of hindrance or is it uh, sort of helpful? Uh, it's probably a little bit of a hindrance really, now we've got a two week break, but, you know, so it just allows people to sit and stew over, over this result really, where we'd like to get straight back into it to put it right if possible, but uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll sit them down now Tuesday in training, uh, we'll get them in training again next Saturday and uh, maybe look to do a bit of something with everybody, a bit of fun. And try and start getting them going again, really, because uh, yeah, the mood in there is pretty flat at the moment. Uh, I think it's flat all over, to be honest. Any other thoughts on the video? Uh, well, I'd just like to uh, give a shout out to my little nephew who's had a uh, tough week in uh, school this week, but Harry Burrows in Exmouth. Keep your head up, son. Keep smiling. Nice one. All the boys got your back.